Good morning YouTube, what's going on? This is Cinnamon Sand and today I am going to show you how to build this very very basic uh, tent here and I have made a tent tutorial before but this one is a different one so this one is inspired by those typical round medieval uh, tents that you could see all around the medieval times which I guess everyone lived in and excuse me if I talk a bit fast because, but I have just drank too much coffee which was not a good idea so I'm sorry for that um, yeah, so we're going to build this one today and actually there are a few different designs and we will go with this one I think. Um, and I am also going to tell you the resources you're going to need for this so that you can rebuild this in survival. Maybe not out of quartz because that is not really um, a cheap block at first, but yeah. So let's head to the tutorial world and oh look, someone has prepared this tutorial actually. So there are the other tents that I've built before, but we're not going to talk about those. We are going to talk about the new tent design. So for the new design, you will need um, eight blocks of, of quartz or something or whatever you want to build the, um, the tent out of. And if you don't have quartz, you could also use, for example, wood, because that looks a bit like uh, leather. Um, the only important thing is that you have uh, stairs and half slab because you're going to need them as well. So you will need 8 full blocks, then 38 stairs, because this tent consists out of a lot of stairs, so that, so that you get um, a lot of space on the inside, or at least as much as possible. Um, we're also going to need one half slab, 8 fences, and 10 wooden planks for the um, floor of this. And you could also add a glowstone to this list if you want uh, some light, as well as a door if you want a door. That might be a good idea, actually. So, um, yeah, we will start off with the eight blocks. So we're going to place them in a circle shape. Well, at least as close as you can get to a circle shape in Minecraft. So that means we will place a block, then uh, leave one block free, another block, then we'll go one block diagonal, one block free, and then again, the same thing until we end up at the beginning again. And we are going to add in the floor as the next part, because that is pretty easy as well. So I'm going to place um, three by three blocks of wood in the middle and then another one for the entr entrance and you can actually leave this one block um, a gla grass block depending on the design but we will talk about that later so the next part are the stairs so we will start off with stairs placed next to the entrance like that just facing the inside and we do that on every side like that and then we will also add in stairs in the gaps over here and over there and then we're going to add in upside down stairs like that just between those so that this is a bigger hole and um yeah here again of course now the difference about the design was if we add in normal stairs like a row of stairs like this if we add in corner stairs like that or if you use half steps over there but i'm not going to do that because that is not very interesting so the next part well, actually, we will continue building those first. The next thing is the entrance, and here are different designs. So, for example, you could make something like this. Then you'd have to place a door from this side. You could also go for the same thing that we did over there. So, two corner stairs, and then one block in the middle, like that. But I will go with this design, I think. Uh -huh. We can change that afterwards anyway. Now, the inside is going to be covered up with a row of stairs again so we'll start here with an upside down stair and then we will go all the way around until we end up over here now the last bit is going to be the top where we place four stairs facing the inside and one half slab to cover up this hole and if you want to pl uh, place a fire on the inside you can leave this one free but i don't think that this is a good place for <laughs> adding um, a fire actually because then your tent might light up if you build it out of wood um, so yeah, if you have a full block, uh, if you have a glowstone, you can place this one over here to give yourself some light. And we're also going to add in fences as supporting pillars and they're going to place next to all the full blocks uh, made out of quartz like that. And now we are pretty much done. You can add in a door if you'd have one. Just a second. There we go. So with this di the design you can't place the door from the outside because then here's a little gap that looks pretty stupid place it on the inside like that again it doesn't look very well because the door is made out of wood and the rest of the tent isn't maybe that would work better if you use the wood in the first place 
And now you can add in your things like a bed or a chest or things like that from the inside. So there is actually enough space for doing that. Uh, whoops, forgot the crafting table. There we go. And as you can see, there's not really much space on the inside. So yeah, it's not the best base, but maybe at, at the beginning or as some kind of an outpost, those tents are pretty nice actually. Um, yeah, so there's not anything else that I wanted to show you today, so that's basically it. Quite short tutorial, actually. Um, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and other than that, I'd say thanks for watching and goodbye.